It's now time, finally, for some really cool science. We're talking bubbles this morning. Here to show us some of all the fun and neat stuff we're going to learn. There it is. Did you see it? <laughs> Shane Montoya and Andrea Dietz. I want to thank you guys so much for joining us this morning. Thanks for having us. So you guys are the bubble experts, right? You know Somewhat. everything about <laughs> bubbles that we need to know. Sure. So let's start with why bubbles at Explora. It's one of those must-stop attractions when you come. You can't leave without making a bubble. Um, it's one of everybody's favorite exhibits. Yeah, so everybody just flocks to the bubbles, right? My daughter, she's two. She loves bubbles, so I totally get it. Yeah. So uh, tell me about this. I was noticing, see how cool that is? Um, this is different than the stuff you buy at the store, right, that you have here. Definitely, yeah. The stuff you get from the store is really good for making tiny bubbles, but um, we have a solution with a little more soap and some little extra add-ins, like... Uh, Baking powder is really good, glycerin, okay. it helps uh, make the bubbles stay a little longer. Okay. So uh, we've been playing around a lot uh, with them, trying to figure out the right solution for our new bubble exhibit that's the opening right in recipe. December. Yeah, so we do a lot of experience, experiments trying to figure that out. Okay. And we, we got a pretty good one, I think, so far we'll still keep testing, but yeah. So what you're telling me is that your job is to make bubbles. Well, right now it is, yeah. Did your mom ever tell you when you're younger, stop blowing bubbles already? It's not going to get you anywhere? Yeah. And now you're like, look at me, look, Mom. What are you yeah. talking about? Look she didn't what know I'm what doing. she was talking about. Yeah. <laughs> so there is hope for all the bubble makers out there. Okay, so real fast, uh, parents out there, get a pan, uh, pan rather, and uh, paper, and we're going to tell you what the ingredients are to this solution here. Tell me what's in here. Okay, so she knows the recipe by heart. Tell me. Then, uh, <laughs> all right, so if you're making bubble solution at home with, say, Dawn dish soap, which is what we use at Explora, you would use one part Dawn soap okay. to five parts water. So like if it's uh, maybe a half a cup of Dawn yeah, soap. Yeah, or like a then... whole cup. You would put okay. five cups of water and one, one whole cup, cup of Dawn uh, soap. soap. So it looks pretty blue, um, but I always say test it before you invite your friends. Okay. Yeah. Make sure it works. Just how yeah. we did with this before yes, we came yes, on and tested it. Yes, yes, we always test it. And are you, do you add more ingredients to make it thick? Well, that's what Shane has been working on yeah. and experimenting with. Um, and what have you discovered? So they're like extra kind of bubble boosters. Um, and so you can get glycerin at um, like craft stores or, or baking mm -hmm. supply places and that helps make it a little thicker. Okay. And that helps you get bigger bubbles and they last longer. How do you um, know how much to add of glycerin, right? Um, just a, like a teaspoon to start. And again, it's testing. You can add it a little bit and you can customize your own bubble solution to what okay. you like. Whoa. Um, you know, depending on the Whoa. environment, um, you know, if, it. it's a hot, <laughs> if it's a hot day, you might need more because uh, bubbles like it cooler. So you might need extra help. Um, but you can also add baking powder and okay. that helps. Uh, and the other one, guar gum, is I another never baking thing. I thought of baking powder. Yeah, we've been trying to figure out That's why it helps, um, and it lowers the pH, and that makes them last longer, okay. and they're much more stable. So you can have your own experiments at home as to how to make the best bubble solution, right? For sure, definitely. So I noticed you guys have a lot of stuff that you do mm -hmm. find at home. This seems to be what, maybe one of those little egg? Easter egg yeah, dyeing yeah. cups. Easter That's what I was Okay. Pringles, uh, yogurt. Wow, this is the so easy. You guys really make good. it look so easy. Try oh, it. It's really curling. easy. Okay, I'll try one. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. I'm like, I'll try one. Although some of them, some of wow, them make big pro. bubbles. Good. Some of them make small bubbles. Ooh, that's interesting. Some of it even makes kind of foamy bubbles. Uh -huh. Yeah, so that's what I want to get to. Let's talk about what you have going on here. Because this is not your typical bubble maker that you no, can see at home. No, it's, well, uh, maybe for the world's smallest bubbles. Yeah. It's, it's the same solution. Foamy. They're just really tiny. Um, and this is an early prototype for our new bubble area that okay. we're working on right now. It's going to open in December. And um, all it is is an aquarium pump and a little air stone with so bubble solution poured into a container and it just keeps foaming and foaming and uh, you can, you know, sculpt with it. You can, you know, make really yeah. cool noises. It sounds really great. Uh, her daughter, Athena, was playing with it yesterday. <laughs> yeah, she discovered now I have to tell sound. you guys, I know you guys put a lot of thought into this, but I really achieved this with my dishwasher See? before. You can do it all at home. Putting the wrong right? dish soap in. You can do it I at home. I achieved this before you guys even knew <laughs> about it. Your own experiment. Well, have you come, in, uh, come help us out. I should, stuff, right? Yeah. So this is all going to be at Explorer, right? All of these cool, neat um, tricks at the new bubble exhibit? Well, we're pr in the prototyping stage now. Um, so when you come to Explore, you can see different shaped ones. We have a big like bubble this. table right now. And we're um, yeah, big bubbles. Now, a lot of these materials that you see here are part of our program. So um, you can 
classes can book and come to us, okay. and we'll show them even more in depth uh, bubble making. Okay. Um, or we can come on outreach and come to you. Perfect. And Real fast, where can people find you? Well, our website. Um, Explora.us. Right? Explora.us. Mm -hmm. Okay, and if you That's want more helpful. information yeah. about Explora, it, just wrong. go to our website, krqb.com. Mm -hmm. We'll have a recap of all of this. We'll have some links there for you. Thank you guys so much for joining us. We'll be right back. Stay there. Thank you. Have fun making bubbles today. <laughs>